This is Magid Zaki. I am with Qualcomm Technologies. I'm the director of technical marketing. Um, as you know, Qualcomm is a leader in wireless technologies, and we are also leader in uh, chipsets. Now we have Snapdragon, Qualcomm Snapdragon. We, beside the wireless technologies, we have a set of mobile computing technologies. One of them is computer vision. And in, today, actually, we are showing some of the capabilities that we are developing on Snapdragon for computer vision. So for computer vision, we are showing a demo today that runs on the Snapdragon 820. And the unique thing about this demo, it completely runs on the HVX DSP within the Snapdragon 820, which makes it very low power, even if the algorithm is very compute intensive. And basically what this algorithm does, the optical flow, it's track the motion. So one of the applications for that is for drone, for instance. It can do position hold. To illustrate that here in the demo, actually BDTI developed a demo for us that shows how optical flow works and how, what it basically gives you. This is the optical flow demo. It's basically show how we can track the motion, the direction of the motion and how fast it goes. So the, I'm standing now in front of the camera. If I move basically right, it will show basically the movement in a specific color. If I move in left, it's going to change the color, say, to a purple color. So it shows the direction. And also, if you notice, the intensity of the color will be uh, based on how fast I move. So if I move quick or if I really move slow. Yeah. Actually, the video shows uh, our Snapdragon flight platform and what it can do. And it shows different features that are used for the drone. Depth from stereo that comes from two cameras in the front that can be used for obstacle avoidance. We are showing also the VIO, uh, which is the visual inertial odometry that's actually used to track the movement of the drone. So if the drone starts in one place, it will be able to go back to the same place because it can track its motion and where it's going. And also we are showing the 4K capabilities. So we are applying these drones for photography. So now you can use the drone to take 4K high quality pictures. So here are just some examples of what we, are do, what we do with computer vision.